guys welcome back to another episode of no man's sky so today i wanted to craft up some uh freighter fuel or frigate fuel uh for missions i wanted to get that um chlorine crafted up and duplicated so we have more chlorine and obviously tend to the farming and stuff but if we have time then what i wanted to do is uh see if we can't explore a little bit more of a little of a planet um there's it the regular tasks shouldn't take too much uh time so i'm not expecting it to take the whole episode for sure so um we'll probably explore another planet today but uh yeah so hopefully we can get that um couple things repaired fully and that will require a little bit of refining and stuff like that but that shouldn't be too bad we have a uh, two refiners down on the first floor there so we should have pretty good capacity for duplicating everything um yeah so last episode what did we do we got one planet fully discovered which is good um uh, all 10 creatures on the extreme planet so if you haven't watched that episode definitely go check that out um okay i i want to see if he has any missions sometimes we get a good deal on stuff so let's see okay. he doesn't actually say what he wants in this part just to accept it so we don't really know what he wants until we actually turn it in Okay, collect agriculture. Do we not have that? Gamma root. Oh, no, we don't. We're not actually growing any of that. Uh, then we should have some. Yeah, we have a little bit. So we'll turn that in. That means we can keep all the other stuff, I guess. Just put some of that over here. I'm trying to collect as much as I can for extra additional stuff, too. So, alright. And we'll hand that in. And then we can um, start working on the uh, chlorine, I guess. Okay, what do we get here? Only 875 years old. Pretty good price for it. I do wish he could actually plant those, though. We'll sell that. We'll sell this. Uh, what else here? Um, the rest we can craft up things with.
right, so I'm going to send out uh, our mining vessel, and I'm not sure if we can actually send out the uh, recon one. We might uh, send that out as well, but um, we'll see what it can do. Uh, we'll select our mining vessel. I've tried to keep the names similar. Um, I think what they've done here with the Normandy is they've set the name of the stealth recon frigate though it's not really with the frigate part at the end i think that's what the srr one stands for um that part i have no idea what that actually means um could be anything really uh something vehicle i'm guessing i'm not sure <laughs> or vessel maybe i don't know but um we'll send the mining vessel out for this one and that should give us two they're pretty skilled so they shouldn't have a problem with that and we'll send them out and for the other guy I'm not sure what his stats are we'll just quickly um, check what the stats are I think it's mostly combat yeah combat and exploration so we could do either or Let's see what options we have and then we'll uh, pick from there I guess Oh, we don't actually have a additional room either. We need to create one of those in order to sh send out another ship. So, hmm. Okay. Um. What we'll do then is we'll place another one of those down. We should have enough to do that. Yeah. And then we'll go ahead and send that other one out. Not sure what we'll get from it, but we'll see what what it does. I got it from one of the expeditions a long time ago, one of the first expeditions that were uh, released, actually. So it was a pretty good um, expedition. It was different. Okay, so we could go with m mining or uh, the other one, uh, exploration. So let's see what we have for exploration. If it's going to match up, yeah, we'll probably. Do fine with that. We'll send that guy out then. And now we can go down to our ship. I did get that um, that one repaired a little bit. And we still need activated copper. I'm not sure if this system has any. So we'll see. We'll check out the uh, planets we've explored and um, see if we can't find some activated copper. Hopefully there is some in this system. I'm not sure though. But we'll, give it a, we'll give it a shot. I have to be really careful. Alright guys, so we're going to have a um, pirate attack in a couple seconds. Just going to prepare for that. You can tell by the little radar there. Okay, they're, <laughs> they're not um, that prepared, I don't think. So we'll just take them on easily. They're only asking for a little bit. 
seeing two of them. Oh, I missed the rockets. That's one. Oh, there's three of them. That's two. Maybe there was just two. Alright, that was fun. Uh, yeah, so I was heading over to, um... Where was it? That planet. Uh, I'm looking for it. <laughs> I mean, we're close to it. I don't know where it is. Uh, that's where I came from. There we go. I found it. Alright, so we're going over here. Um, hot planet, salvage scrap, not... I can't remember what those are for. But, um... If I remember correctly, sentinels don't like you picking them up, so... We'll have to check it out and see what's up with uh, all that. But it uh, looks like it's in the middle of a storm right now. Try to get a visual. It's a, um, oh, what was it? it I think it was a um, barren planet or something like that. Can't remember the exact words. Looks pretty hot though. And very mountainy. So we'll have to find a, a suitable landing location, I think. And uh, we'll take it from there, but um Yeah, we'll we'll want to find somewhere that's relatively flat so we can explore a little bit. Maybe this valley would do. Land somewhere around here. Just make sure that there's no storm crystals or anything like that. It doesn't look like it's a, a extreme planet. It does have a lot of mushrooms though. So, I tried getting all the creatures on that one planet. We're going to need to go back and uh, check that out. But uh, in the meantime, I can basically assist with that with, by making a um, 
what was it the thing that we unlocked not too long ago orbital exocraft um materializer so we just need uh two more um warp cells for that and we should be able to place one of those down so what i'm going to do is i'm going to place that down at the end of the hall over here for now and that way it's out of the way and stuff for because i want to expand that side over eventually so i think it would do pretty nicely over here and it's one of those things that you don't really interact with that much either so it's just it's more of a upgrade more or less so that's the uh the room and then we'll be able to spawn in any exo craft that we have at any point in time as long as our freighter is in the same system so that will be really handy for that part um as far as the mission board i think they're not done yet um probably next week we'll um because it's friday for me so i don't record until monday so next week I'll, they'll probably be done for sure and then we'll be able to see what we get for the rewards and stuff like that but outside of that if you are new to my channel don't forget to subscribe comment down below rate the video and i will see you guys next time thanks for watching peace out Thank you.